All right, Sean, what in blue blazes is going on? You're up on the roof in this weather? Nothing, Dad. Me and Gus were just practicing base jumping. It's the newest thing in extreme sports. Are you crazy? You could get yourself seriously hurt or maybe even killed doing something like this. Don't worry, Dad. We made life-size replicas of ourselves to make sure the shoots would work. Mine's over there. We've made improvements since then. Base jumping. <laughs> Sean, there's no way here we'll let you do something that risky. But, Dad... But nothing. As long as you live in my house, you follow my rules. I want you to clean this stuff up, come inside, and do your homework. Gus, come on. You're smarter than this. Well, one day I won't be living in your house. Then I'll be able to take any risk I want. What about that? Okay. When you and Gus are 30 years old, you can go out and be as wild and reckless as you want. Best idea ever. People say our intense love of bunnies is creepy at our age, but history will prove them to be heartless bastards. I can't believe the French actually eat these little guys. The French aren't the only ones. What? No, I wasn't counting other rabbits. Rabbits don't eat each other, Sean. Most rabbits, yes. No, pretty much all. You know what? This conversation will only end badly. The thing is, I have something big to tell you. You know you can say anything to me, Gus. We've known each other forever, and there's absolutely nothing that could dent our impenetrable bond. I have a secret girlfriend. You're dead to me. Sean, you brought me all the way down here. You hopped up on bunny love, so you could spring this on me, and I would make a scene. Pretty much. Well, it's working. I don't even remember what this whole thing was about. <laughs>